Hey, welcome back to another episode of Simple Truth Television. Today is June 10th, 2020. In this video, I want to discuss the death of a former New York Yankee player, Claudel Washington, who passed away at the age of 65 from prostate cancer. He passed away today at the age of 65, a former New York Yankee. But before we start, I just want you guys to let me know if you guys can hear me before we start the presentation. How you doing, everybody? I'm L equals 13. M equals 13. Vanessa, how you guys doing? So if you guys can confirm the audio, we can get started. Appreciate that, Vanessa. Thank you very much. So this is a baseball player. He passed away at the age of 65 from prostate cancer. He used to play for the New York Yankees, and he also used to play for the New York Mets. He died at the age of 65. Supposedly, he played 17 seasons in the major leagues. 17, the number associated with the word kill, right? But notice this, right? So if you read the headline, one of the first things they say is that he was a Yankees outfielder. You know, they, they mentioned the Mets, and they also mentioned the Yankees. And there's a reason for that. It's because in Gematria, New York Yankees, sums to 65, like the age that this man passed away, 65. When you write out Met, he was a Met outfielder. The word Met sums to 38, and it also sums to 11. Today has a life lesson number of 11. Of course, the, the word murder sums to 38, death, killing, R.I.P. But this baseball player, he was born on August 31st, 1954. He played 17 seasons. In Jamaica, the word kills sums to 17. But notice from the day that he passed away, which is today on June 10th to August 31st, he died 83 days before his birthday. 83. And his name in Gematria, Claudel Washington, sums to 83. Just like the word murder. Now think about the song Murder by Numbers, which was released in 1983 by the band The Police, right? The word murder sums to 83, then the song comes out in 1983. He died from prostate cancer, according to the reporting, right? And if you notice the first sentence, it says that um, he made his first major league start on July 8, 1974. And it says that his first game was an epic, an instant epic. July 8th, right? So from his birthday that year, 1974, to the to the his first major league baseball start, he began playing 54 days before his birthday. 54 days. And of course, that's the number associated with major league, right? There's 54 outs in a complete game. Each team gets 27 outs, 27 plus 27 sums to 54. The word baseball sums to 54 in Gematria. MLB sums to 54. And he began his ML career, his MLB career 54 days before his birthday. And he passed away on June 10th, 2020. And of course, this year is a leap year. So June 10th is the 162nd day of the year. Major League Baseball sums to 162, right? Think about how there's 162 games in a regular season. You know, that is not the case this year because of the pandemic, but usually during, you know, average years, baseball play, they, they play 162 games. So no, no surprise why we get a baseball-related death on the 162 day of the year. And, of course, a baseball player, right? So... But notice baseball also sums to 162, just like Major League. And today's a day with 56 numerology, outfielder sums to 56. And also today has a um, day numerology of 20, and the word death equals 20. If you guys are new here, I recommend you visit this website, gematrinator.com. And this is the site that I use to decode words and phrases. But notice today, June 10th, has a date 
the numerology of 56, the outfielder sums of 56, also has a life lesson number of 20, the word death equals 20, he was a Mets, Met equals 11, and of course today's the 162nd day of the year, Major League Baseball is 162, Baseball is 162, that's 162 games in the regular season. So normally on the 162nd day of the year, we always get some tragedy in the world of baseball. It happens almost every single year. If you go back and look at how many baseball players died on June on June 10th or June 9th, you're gonna see a lot of baseball players died on that day. Because it's the 162 day of sec, the 162nd day of the year. So R.I.P. this man. A very legendary player, you know, he played 17 seasons. But, um, yeah, so if you guys are new here, visit this website. Go where it says tools, click on the calculator, and learn the four base ciphers. The alphabetical order in forwards and the alphabetical order in reverse. And then the two ciphers where you apply the rules of numerology. Very simple stuff. So this play was a Met. Met equals 38. Like murder, death, killing, R.I.P. And like uh, we saw today, also has a, a date numerology of 11. So the perfect day for this man to die. A former Yankee and a former Met player. Dead at the age of 65. And also the, the phrase, the word pandemic sums to 65. He died in the middle of this whole coronavirus pandemic. But that's all I have. Um, I'll be right back. You know, I'm going to have a, a call-in show. I don't know how much people are going to be active. As you guys can see, there's only 20 people watching the live stream. So I don't know if it'll be worth it. You know, if only 20 people are watching the live stream, I mean, are we going to listen to the same 20 callers calling? So I'm waiting for my channel to build back up before we can have the radio show that I usually used to have. But, you know, it's just, it's, a, it's an ongoing struggle. When you're on somebody else's platform, you know. But, um. Yeah, I'll see. I'll, I'll, I'll be back around 10 minutes. And if people are here. Then I'll definitely have the call in show. So. You guys take care and I'll see you in a few.